After months of waiting, Pfizer is preparing to meet with the Food and Drug Administration to see if its vaccine will go from emergency use to fully well, approved. Basically what they're looking for is data and looking for more data that has been collected since the vaccine has been in use under the emergency use authorization. Data that shows its effectiveness and safety among the millions of Americans who are already vaccinated. The emergency use authorization process began in 2004 during an anthrax scare. There was a concern that uh, anthrax might be weaponized and be used as a uh, biological uh, bioterrorism uh, weapon. Um, to attack uh, the United States, uh, to attack the U.S. military. Congress created this process back in 2004 after the anthrax scare. Basically, it makes it easier to quickly approve things that could conceivably help during a health crisis. Uh, once uh, a COVID vaccine, or one or more COVID vaccines, do have uh, full FDA approval, they will be handled just like other vaccines. Meaning required like others. Dr. Thomas Campbell, Chief Clinical Research Officer at UC Health, says a full approval could mean big changes, like healthcare providers prescribing it based on the label or based on their own judgment. Providers could recommend a third dose of the vaccine to those immunosuppressed patients that uh, that might need it. Dr. Campbell believes this approval could encourage more. He says to get the shot now while it's free, which a full approval could change. I'm Darius Johnson for Nine News.